What's up YouTube? Welcome to another video. Once again, before I get started, don't forget to hit that like or dislike and please subscribe. And this video is going to be about things you should know about prison and doing time in jail. And this video is probably geared to people who haven't been to jail or prison, although people who have been can take something from this video. But in my opinion, this video is mainly for people who haven't went. So uh, I'm going to get started. But the main things you need to know about prison, for the most part, is boring. It's boring as hell. It's boring as scary, yeah. It's boring because it never, nothing ever go on. I mean, it's the same thing every day, day in and day out. So it's boring because nothing ever happened. And scary because anything can happen, you know, which is the, you know, trip part about it. But for the most part, it's boring. And I know how um, Hollywood, they show you all the rapings and stabbings, you know, all the excitement, you know, the sensationalism. But they don't show you the day in, day out part of prison. You know why? Because it's boring, you know, <laughs> you know, and that's another thing about prison, in my opinion, is more mental than physical. You know, you can really see grown men cry there, you know just dealing with the stress and for a number of reasons you know family women etc trust me it is it, it's, it's, it's real mental you know jail it kind of remind me of um prison when i was little you know and uh say if your mom took you to the babysitter house or somebody house that you didn't want to be but since you're young you got no control and you couldn't be there i'm telling you the first my first time going to jail to prison that's the same feeling i felt on the side note but anyway um yeah, for the most part, it's boring, you know, because that never happened here, like I said, it, and it's all mental, and um, let's see, um, and while you're there, be who you say you is, you know, be who you say you are, um, there's been plenty of situations where people lying about what they got, what they did, who they done screwed, or whatnot, and um, they done ran into a wreck, you know, simply put it. You know, just for running their mouth, front and putting the two on the ten. So, just be who you say you is. Um, mind your business. You know, um, stay off the wire. Those don't know what the wire is. This is basically speaking across the uh, the cells. You know, on the wire to somebody else where everybody else can hear you. Again, stay off the wire. Um, it's been plenty of situations where people. Uh, Naming names, dates, places, faces, and not knowing who listening, and they done ran into a brick wall. So stay off the wire. Um, don't gamble. Now, of course, plenty of people don't follow that rule. I've been guilty of not following that rule before, but if you don't gamble, that can uh, keep you out of a lot of trouble, a lot of unnecessary um, BS that come with the gambling. I'm pretty sure you heard the stories. Of uh, people owing other people from different cars, you know, I've seen situations where somebody owe and they roll themselves up. So then, you know, you go to whatever car he at, you know, now they owe it. They, hey man, he ain't with us or whatever, you know, you know what's gonna happen. So don't gamble, um, don't steal. You can take all you want, but don't steal. Again, plenty of situations, can't get caught stealing, you know likely you're going to get DP'd and rolled up out of there. But you can take all you want, again, but don't steal. There's a difference. You know, um, speaking, another thing, the thing about going to jail and prison, every experience is different. So, and that kind of correlates with as far as it being unpredictable. So, just because you did time before don't mean when you go to prison again and go to another yard, it's going to be the same way. You may get a whole different experience. So, you know, you got to keep that in mind, especially somebody that's in and out of jail. You know, um, again, which um, must be said, you ain't guaranteed to come up out that thing. You know, it's, um, and I don't care where you at, whether you're at a level one or a level four or shoot, you ain't guaranteed to come up out of there. Been plenty of situations. We're on a level one or two. Somebody calling the camp Snoopy. 
and two or three months down the line, I've seen them getting blasted. You know, I've seen it with my own eyes. So every experience can be different, you know, which again is another thing. Just because you've been to jail and prison, you know, before, don't mean you know how to do time. And I'm going to say that again. Just because you've been in jail or prison, a lot of times, don't mean you know how to do time. I've been in plenty of situations, again, where, um, especially when I first went in, I have seen people where, um, by my definition, my standard, would have been more thorough than me, but doing something silly, moving frivolous, and end up getting into a wreck and getting balled up, you know, being that they didn't did this, plenty of times in and out of jail you would think there would be more experience but again just because you've been in jail and prison don't mean you know how to do time and all that correlate with your mental that's what i was saying earlier jail for the most part is more mental as far as stress uh your character be who you say you are that's what i'm saying things you can take from prison especially if you uh end up doing time especially if you're one of these youngsters out here you know, and that come with the territory. You're going to go to jail. And um, if you with somebody, that, you know, likely they're going to tell. So think about all that. But that really ain't what this video is about. The video really basically is, in my opinion, things people out there should know about prison. You know, perhaps the things that they don't too much talk about in the movies as far as the whole mental aspect in the day-to-day -day about doing time in prison, you know, the straight stress mode, you know, um, that's pretty much what I wanted to highlight on this